In this video, I'm going to describe how ridge tracing works in CSI PIX. Ridge tracing is available in versions 5.00 and higher. It's an annotation function. It's used to help with tracing friction ridges. The ridges must be darker than the background, and the image must be calibrated to use this function. You find it by opening the annotation docker and clicking pen slash ridge tracing. Then you place two points on one ridge. Place them less than an inch apart. Usually it can be further if the ridge is well defined and or straight. The algorithm will look for the darkest continuous path between the two points and then fill it in. If you don't like the path, you can undo last. You can also use control Z or control Z to undo last, by the way. Use pen mode to go around sharp turn. So switch out of ridge tracing mode and go to pen mode if you want to go around a sharp turn. After a ridge has been drawn, they're treated as freehand annotations. So now I'll demonstrate how to use it. So to get to ridge tracing, you click annotate on the menu bar. Put it in draw mode click pen slash ridge tracing then you'll be asked if you want to do pen mode or ridge tracing click ridge tracing now you place pairs of points to draw a ridge so you can select your color then you click on a ridge To switch colors, you just go up here. You can see with this ridge, I can probably go pretty far apart because it's very well defined. If you don't like a ridge that it found, like right here, you can do Control Z or you can click on this, Undo Last, and you can redo it in shorter pieces. You can't pan when you're in ridge tracing mode. You can use full image and then zoom region if you want to move. But I want to show you how to go around a sharp corner. So click set point one to get back in the mode for drawing ridges. Put back in draw mode if you're not there. Now this is kind of irregular, so I'm going to go back to pen mode to do this. So just click here again and click pen mode. and trace it and now you can go back to ridge tracing mode to continue. When you're done with ridge tracing you just click close. So that's ridge tracing. Thank you for watching. Feel free to reach out if you have any comments or questions.